This week for Where in the State, it's all about food, glorious food. My favorite thing, Jess. <laughs> I thought I was going to throw her up, but she did pretty good. No, we got to get in there and get some fancy vittles. V oh, but <laughs> you stole my word, vittles. She stole my word. Anyway, we are in eastern Oklahoma County in Choctaw, to be exact, and a place off of 29th Street that fits in the name, but we're going to show you more. It's delicious. Over the next few weeks, Rachel and I are going to spotlight some hidden gem restaurants in our state that offer some of the best meals in Oklahoma. Like today's hidden gem, Fred's Cafe 29. It's a roadside diner that's worth the stop for breakfast or dinner. We sit down with Fred himself, Fred Pomplin, and owner Jose Zanabria. Fred tells us why his cafe has become a place that the community gathers. No fancy menu, just basic menu and daily specials once in a while that change. But the idea was to have the atmosphere to bring people down, and have conversations and coffee and eat. Owner Jose Zanabria loves the vibe that Fred's Cafe 29 gives off. I think the atmosphere, the, the people, and everyone that comes through here, you know, more than anything else has made this possible and continues to. So it's it's great atmosphere. And Jeff, Fred's customers love to brag about this place. Um, my name is Lloyd Marshall. Fred's is a good cafe. They got good food, they got good help here. The waitresses are excellent people. I'm David. Great service, good food, good atmosphere, and wonderful prices. Enough talk, Jed. Roll that mouth-watering home-cooked food. We'll then plan a trip to Choctaw and maybe meet Jose and Fred. Fred and Jose, why would you like to tell the viewers to come see you? <laughs> you guys really want a good, good meal, good service. You need to go over and check out that Fred's Cafe over on 29th Street. The food is good, the service is great, and I go there a lot because I own the place. <laughs> we definitely would love to invite you to Fred's. Uh, it's a great place, great atmosphere. Uh, not only the fresh food, but if anything else, you're always going to find something then good for the tummy because it's yummy. So believe me by when I say this, uh, you only find it here at Fred's 29th Cafe. Okay, Rachel, we've been talking about it. We've been showing it. Other people have been talking about it. Yeah, can we finally eat it, Jeff? The food, yeah, we can, but I got to get mine ready. So do you need anything special okay. for yours? Uh, no, I'll probably need a little bit of pepper. A little I bit? Don't, no, what, How about is, like that? What is happening? I'm putting pepper on my, on my breakfast. This is the breakfast bomb, by the way. And it comes, I left half of it for you. You're okay. Scrambled eggs, biscuits. We got the gravy. We got the sausage. What? Eat it however you want it. Yeah, or eat it like I do. A lot of pepper because it's so good. I'm going to yeah. stick to this picture. Why don't you say that? <laughs> oh, yeah. Are you sure this isn't the bomb? Because it's pretty no. the bomb. Obviously, spaghetti, you can tell what it is. <laughs> it's a daily special, see, we have to come in and ask for it. Can we switch now? Can I try that? Oh, okay. Not the Boy, why do you keep looking at my pepper? When you eat your way, I'll eat my way. Good night, Martha. Did you try the garlic bread? They don't need to watch us eat the whole thing. Mm. Okay, well, she was going to tell you, tell everybody you heard about Fred's Cafe 29 on Where in the Steak. Where in the Steak. There we go. You didn't swallow yet. 